She say I'm obsessed with thick women and I agree Yeah, that's right, I like my girls, BBW Yeah Hello Dope Nation, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome. My name is Monique aka Dope Chick Mona and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the perfect glam for quarantine season. This is for the people that lost their motivation for putting on makeup because you know we have to wear masks everywhere we go. I got a real bomb glam look for you guys today, so if you guys are interested to see what I come up with, continue to watch. I usually start my makeup videos off with brows and concealed eyes, but I did not start it off with like that because in order to get a really slayed look while wearing your mask, you have to make sure your brows and your eyes, AKA your eyeshadow, your wing liner, your mascara, your lashes, you have to make sure those are on point because basically down here is not gonna be shown. Up here is what needs to really stand out. I'm starting with my brows. What I'm going to go in with is my Anastasia Dip Brow and I'm going to conceal them with my e.l.f. concealers. One is darker for on top of my brow and then the other one is is lighter for under my brow to shape it up. the brows are filled now it is time to prime your eyelids you really want to prime your eyelids one to conceal the dark marks around your eyes if you have some and two so your eyeshadow could stick for a long time throughout the day I'm using the Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion and it's in the shade caffeine with the Anastasia palette and I'm also going in with the Juvia's Place Zulu palette and I'm taking the orange. That's the only shade that I'm going to be going in with. I'm going to be taking Believe and putting that into my crease and then I'm going to use Texas Made and blend that out and then I'm going in the Zulu palette by Juvia's Place and I'm going to blend the pink out with this orange. shade believe which is the purple and then on my lid I'm going to use the orange from the Zulu palette So that is it for the eyes so far. Now we're on to our base. Since the weather is getting warmer now, I need to make sure my skin is extra matte because I am a super oily girl. So I'm going in with two primers. The first thing I'm going in with is my e.l.f. Oil Control Primer Mist. And then I'm going in with my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Soft Retouch. face is staying on a lot with these two primers now it's time for foundation I'm going to go in with my Maybelline what is this super stay full coverage foundation and I am in the shade 362 which is truffle and lately I've been using my beauty blenders for my foundation on I don't know what made me start doing this but I've been loving it <laughs> Next 
Next, I'm going in with my concealer again. This is the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. It's in the shade Deep Chestnut. And I'm going to highlight my T-zone and I'm also going to cut this eyeshadow so it could look sharp. Going to set my t-zone as well i'm going in with the julius place i am magic setting powder in the shade goby now it's time to cream contour i'm going in with my makeup revolution cream foundation and it is in the shade f18 to set my cream contour and I'm also gonna bronze I'm using my Fenty Beauty Sun Stalker and Mocha Mommy okay now I'm going to blend everything together I'm going in with my MAC mineralized skin finish in dark deep and I'm going in with my blush I'm going in with the elf blush palette and I'm using these two pinks okay now I'm going to spray my face with some fix plus from Mac all right back to the eyes I'm gonna go in with the same colors again so I could make sure it's really really opaque before I go in with my eyeliner and my eyelashes now it's time for eyeliner i'm going in with my mac fluid line in black Trash. take my liquid liner and I'm going to extend my inner tear duct and I'm going to give me a cat eye look because you know you have to go real dramatic with the eyes that you're wearing a mask so. and now I'm going to really go dramatic and I'm going to add some glitter this is the Too Faced glitter pop peel off eyeliner it is in the shade kitty glitter So the eyes are looking good, looking almost snatched because now I have to put my eyelashes on. So I'm going to do that off camera because it's a hassle and then I'll come right back. All right, I'm back. I zoomed you guys up a little bit so you guys can see what I'm doing with the bottom lash line. I'm going back in with the palette. I'm going to start with Believe, blend it out with Texas Made, and then blend it out with the orange and the Zulu palette. <music> Now time for mascara. I'm going in with the Too Faced Better Than Sex Waterproof Mascara and I'm going to blend my real lashes with my falsies and I'm going to put some on the bottom lash line. time I'm going in with my Jaclyn Hill highlighter palette is in the shade the flare I'm using media look and I'm using exposure 
both of them and then I'm going to top it off with my Fenty Beauty Fairy Balm in Copper Chill. Okay, now for the lips, I'm going in with my MAC Lip Liner in Chestnut and I'm going in with my Fenty Beauty Lipstick. It is her Popsicles Lipstick line and it's in the shade Sun Snatched. finish off the lips with my gloss balm it's from Fenty Beauty and it's in Fenty Glow now the last step to make your makeup last a long time you need to go in with a setting spray that will hold your makeup still I'm using the Urban Decay All Nighter Spray all right the look is done so this is how the eyes came out all right time for the mask i ordered my mask from fashion nova and they really had a lot of dope masks on the site but this is the one that i ended up getting it looks like this and it is called if you can read this face mask <laughs> it's in black and white it says if you can read this you're too close. Six feet apart, people. Six feet apart. And then at the bottom, it says fashion. I hope you guys like how this look came out. I hope you guys like my eyes with the mask on as well. If you guys lost your inspiration for putting on makeup and being creative, I hope this video gave you a little push to let you dig into your makeup and put your makeup on and do looks like this, film them, put on YouTube, you know, take pictures, put on Instagram, you know, to lighten up your day because it's a really dark time and we need a lot of brightness. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye